Hello there. After a record-breaking bank holiday Monday, we're going to see a split in fortunes as we move through Tuesday with outbreaks of rain across western parts, but also it will stay quite warm and dry across the eastern side of the country. But back to bank holiday evening, plenty of late low sunshine for many of us. However, as we move into the overnight period, the mist and fog that has plagued some Irish sea coasts through the day will move further inland to affect parts of Wales, the west country in particular. But much of England and Wales and into Scotland Scotland will be dry with clear skies. But despite this, temperatures won't fall much lower than 12 to 14 degrees. Towards the end of the night, though, we will see thicker cloud, outbreaks of rain moving into parts of Northern Ireland. This will give a wet start to Tuesday morning. And as we move through the morning, this rain will slowly spread its way eastwards, moving into parts of Scotland, later on into parts of Northern England, Wales and the West Country. But it becomes lighter and patchier as it does so. Ahead of it, though, much of England and Wales and also eastern Scotland will stay dry and bright with plenty of sunshine. Shine, though the heat in the southeast could just spark one or two heavy showers, perhaps even thundery in nature, with highs of 27, possibly 28 still in the London area. So well above average for the time of year. Fresher air, though, moving into the far west behind the frontal system with sunshine and showers for Northern Ireland and a high of 15 degrees. For the rest of Tuesday, that band of patchy rain will move out into the North Sea. We'll see clearing skies across the whole of the UK through Tuesday night. This could allow one or two patches of mist and fog to develop, mostly across western parts of the UK. And under the clearing skies and light winds, much more comfortable for sleeping, temperatures down to 7 or 8 degrees for most. What this means, though, is Wednesday will dawn on a bright, sunny note for many. Any mist and fog will soon clear away. However, through the morning, we'll see further cloud, outbreaks of rain and stronger winds start to move into the northwest. This will, through the day, slowly push its way eastwards into the western fringes of England and Wales. Some of the rain could be heavy at times, and under that cloud and rain, temperatures really disappointing, 10 to 12 degrees. But ahead of it, in the brighter sky still, temperatures high teens, perhaps 20 degrees in southeast England, so still well above average for the time of year.